So what's good y'all, it's your boy Nabari here with a video today We're going to be talking about the new team of the week players that dropped in Madden 18 today First we have Derek Carr, I'm going to show you guys his sets, what players is going to the sets So you put all these cards into the set so you can get this 90 Derek Carr The first card that gets put into the set is Andy Janovich Somebody really want to spend 194k on a fullback Let's see why. He has 75 speed, 76 strength, 82 awareness with 80 run block. That's good and all, but I don't know if I would spend like almost 200k on a fullback, bro. Somebody really bought him for 270k. Wow. <laughs> I guess, bro. I guess. Next up is this dude, Larry Warford, right guard from the... Oh, Saints. Okay. He has a damn. He's better than Shaq Mason. He has 85 straight, 85 run block, 85 pass block, 85 impact block, 85 awareness, and 81 stamina. Okay, he's not that better than Shaq Mason. He's just like plus one, plus some. But this looks like a decent uh right guard. Let's see how much he's going for. He's going for at least 60k. So it's not bad. Marvin Jones, wide receiver from the Detroit Lions, man. What he's he's going for. 35k he has 86 speed 76 catching 82 spec catch 81 release 79 route running with 80 catching traffic that's not bad bro there's christian mccaffrey he has 87 speed 91 agility 90 acceleration 77 carrying 76 elusiveness with 79 juke then there's travis benjamin you know this dude is fast he has 88 speed 75 catching 75 spectacular catch 70 release 75 route running with 86 jumping you know that dude's fast man i forgot his nickname what they call him then there's evan ingram i want to get this dude because it's like having a receiver at tight end this dude has 86 speed 65 strength 63 run block 74 catches 71 release 67 route running 74 spectacular catch but he is a tight end with 86 speed the run blocking is eh but just that speed alone like i definitely would want him on my team Next is the right tackle from the 49ers, Trent Brown, 75 overall. He has 87 strength, 69 run block, 74 pass block, 69 impact block. Why does this dude have a card, man? Like, this is horrible. That's so horrible for a lineman. I mean, if you just started in Mutt, then yeah, get him. He'll probably be a good cheap price, but damn, 69 impact block, that's horrible. Next we have is Trey Hopkins, man. 74 overall left guard for the Bengals. He has 83 straight, 78 run block, 71 pass block with 63 impact block. That is blasphemy. <laughs> the draft pick that the Bears gave up a lot for, which I still don't understand. He has 79 speed, 69 throw power, 69 throw accuracy short, 68 throw mid, 66 throw deep, 70 throw on the run. I mean, we do got to cut EA some slack because it's just the beginning of Mutt. They're going to get better cards, better stats in the long run. Shouldn't expect a lot in like the first team of the week. You know what I'm saying? So, all right, then we have Ben Ijalana. 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 <laughs> Left tackle from the Jets, man. 80 straight, 68 run block, 69 pass block, 73 impact block. Then we have uh, the center, Ryan Jensen from the Baltimore Ravens. He has 86 strength, 64 run block, 70 pass block with 67 impact block. I feel like the lower the cards in the set, the worse they are, man. And the last one for the offensive set, it is Pharaoh Cooper, wide receivers for the LA Rams. He has 83 speed, 62 catches, 60 elusiveness, 60 release, 60 route running, 59 catching traffic with 81 jumping. Now let's get into the defensive set. So the defensive I want to say hero, like there's an offensive hero, and then there's a defensive hero. It's Tyron Matthew, and these are the cards that go into his set. I feel like it's more worth it to get the defensive players with the team of the week than the offensive players because there's so much heat on the defensive side, man. First card that's going to be the most expensive card in the set is going to be Jason Pierre Paul. 88 overall, he has 75 speed, 81 straight, 81 acceleration, 90 tackle, 85 block shed, 80 power move, 88 finesse move, with 88 play recognition. This is a beast card. I'm telling you guys, this is a beast card. Defensive side got some heat. Then it's my dude, Michael Kendricks 
from the Eagles. You guys already know I'm fly Eagles fly all day. This man has 84 speed, 73 straight, 84 tackling, 84 rec play rec, 84 block shed, 82 power move with 84 hit power. And it's crazy that the Eagles are really talking about trading this dude. Like, I hope they do not trade him. Like, he was killing this preseason, man. He's showing out. I hope we don't get rid of him, man. We better not. Next up is my dude, VH3. He's going for, you know, 24K or whatever. 84 overall. He has 86 speed. 87 acceleration, 90 agility, 81 band, 77 zone. I think it should be higher. 84 press, 75 play rec with 73 catch. Next up is my favorite user, man, Hassan Reddick. I have his gold card that I use because this dude is fast, man. 82 overall middle linebacker. He has 85 speed, 75 acceleration, 76 tackle, 75 play rec, 77 block shed, 83 pursuit, 70 zone with 78 hit power. Next up is Marshawn Lattimore, cornerback from the New Orleans Saints. 90 speed, 87 acceleration, 87 agility, 75 man with 70 zone. Mm. I don't know i just like that speed man 90 speed that's good for a defensive back then we have jj watts little brother tj watt he was beasting in the preseason man i'll give him that he has 79 speed 73 strength 79 tackle 68 play rec 70 block shed 69 power move 74 from this move with 77 hit power then it's hassad richway he has 67 speed 83 strength 79 acceleration 74 block shedding and he has 74 power move. All right, we got another middle linebacker, Ben Jadinion, or however you say his name. He has 79 speed, 65 awareness, 72 tackle, 65 play rec, 66 block shed, and with 70 pursuit. Then it's Quincy Mauger, strong safety from the Falcons. He has 82 speed, 86 acceleration, 55 play rec. Oh my gosh. 63 man, 71 zone, 74 pursuit with 76 hit power. Next is Dexter McCoy from the LA Chargers. He has 82 speed, 88 acceleration, 61 play rec, 63 man, 67 zone. He's just horrible. <laughs> He's just horrible. Why? Why continue to read that off, man? And then there's this card right here. This what is it? 71 overall cornerback from the Jets. His name is Justin Barres. He has 84 speed, 86 acceleration, 84 agility, 64 man, 61 zone with 66 press. And for the last player that goes into this set is Devon Godcho. Or Godcho? I don't know how to say that. I think it's Godcho. But um, he has 72 speed, 84 strength, 65 tackle, 64 block shed, 53 power move, 63 finesse move, 61 play recognition with 61 pursuit. I. Now let's see if we have these heroes on the auction block. All right, I can't tell. I don't know, man. I think there's more Derek Cars than Tyron Matthew, but anyway, we're gonna start for Tyron Matthew. 90 overall Tyron Matthew team of the week. He has 86 speed, 89 acceleration, 88 play rec, 78 tackle, 87 man with 88 zone, 87 pursuit with 86 hit power. I wish I had the coins, man. I really do. This is a beastie free safety, especially now. I know it's the beginning of mutt, but still, like, this is a good car to have. And then, lastly, we're going to go with Derek Carr, 90 overall team of the week, 80 speed, 86 awareness, 88 throw power, 85 throw short, 83 throw mid, 83 throw deep, 84 play action with 88 throw on the run. Let me compare him to my dude Matthew Stafford, and he beats him in almost everything except for throw power. And, uh, yeah, I know Matthew Stafford played good for me. Some people don't like Matthew Stafford because they say he, like, overthrows. I have, like, bad throws from him from time to time, but not a lot. But this Derek Carr is dope. Like, to have 80 speed, 80 speed is good to, like, scramble with and stuff, too. But, yeah, this is a good card. All right, so you guys let me know what you think about the Team of the Week players, man. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. And I'm going to catch you guys next video.